Hello folks and welcome to your next Model 3 Drive Unit FOC update. Uh, we just made some progress so I thought I would shoot a quick video here. Welcome also to the craziest testing setup I think that I have ever done. So without further ado uh, I'm going to connect the oil pump to this 12 volt battery here. Uh, so the first sound that you're going to hear is going to be the electric oil pump, the 12 volt electric pump in the drive unit spinning up. Uh, so let's do that. There's our oil pump is now running. Uh, we're going to kick our inverter into run mode. It's now in run mode. I'm going to get out of the way if I can. Observe the Musco uh, drive shaft cups. We've got our E46 throttle, Prius inverter, and we'd be running with field orientated control. At the minute, we're not running particularly fast because we've only got about 60 volts of battery on here, so that's why we're not doing 19,000 RPM. Uh, but as you can see, it's super smooth. Got no vibration in the motor at all there. It's using so little current that I don't even need to have the coolant running uh, through the Prius inverter and as we all know the Prius inver inver inverters need coolant but uh, we're taking about you know pulses of current oh there goes the drive shaft cup out that side um, okay um, we're, we're taking pulses of current of about, I better turn off the oil pump, of about uh, maybe 30 amps. Um, so, there you have it. Um, FOC control for the first time of our uh, Model 3 drive unit uh, using the Prius Gen 3 inverter. Just to reiterate to people uh, who haven't been following, the purpose of using the Prius inverter here is so that we can fine tune our control system uh, before we translate that into the original uh, inverter because I'd much rather blow up a $40 Prius inverter than a million dollar uh, Tesla one. So that's the story folks. Um, not sure if that's a world first or a Damien first or a nobody first. Uh, but we have closed loop control on this uh, drive unit now. I'd like to particularly thank the people that responded in the comments section uh, to the last video that I did on this because learning that it's a six pole motor with a three pole uh, resolver uh, was pretty much the makings of this thing. Um, pretty much today, as soon as I put it on, it did the exact same again. It didn't rotate even with very high ID. So I started off, I said I'll start off methodically and I'll swap the polarity on the resolver, sine, cosine, exciter, and I'll swap them around. And what turned out, the very first thing that I did was I swapped the polarity on the sine, put some manual ID in, and the motor started spinning, so I knew I had it uh, then. So, yeah, that's it, folks. I'll keep this one short. Uh, we will do a much more in-depth on this later, but... As always, don't forget, 
dislike, unshare, unsubscribe, click that unsubscribe button, click some of that hate. Uh, we will see you in our next Musk video. And until then, check the links in the description for GitHub and Patreon and PayPal and Open Inverter Forum and anything else I can think to put in there. And uh, until then, as always, happy Model 3 drive unit FOC spinning.